simple machines, inclined plane, screw. There are machines all around us. We use them every day, all the time. An electric fan helps us cool down. An electric mixer helps us grind our food. The sewing machine stitches our clothes. A hammer helps us bang nails into place. A lemon squeezer helps us to make lemonade. A pair of tongs are useful in lifting hot vessels. A knife helps us slice things easily. A scissor is used for cutting. So, what is a machine? A machine is something that makes our work easier. Machines that have few or no moving parts are known as simple machines. These devices have only one or two parts and a simple structure. Some machines have many parts joined to one another. Such machines are called complex machines. Parts of such complex machines are actually simple machines. We use simple or complex machines depending upon the task, time or efforts required. We use a lot of simple machines to move heavy loads from one point to another. Let us study some of the most simple machines. Have you heard of an inclined plane? An inclined plane is the simplest of all machines. Inclined means slanting. So, an inclined plane is just a slanting surface. This is an inclined plane. That's all it is. A ramp is an inclined plane. A ramp works by helping you lift things more easily up to a higher level. Look at the boy. He wants to lift the barrel on a ledge. He needs a lot of effort to do so. With the help of an inclined plane, he can now roll the barrel with much less effort. It is really difficult to carry a load of stuff up a ladder. But carrying that load up a staircase is an easier job. Carrying it up a smooth ramp is even easier. Suppose we want to lift an object. We can just lift it up directly. Now, let's make an inclined plane to pull up this object. We can tie a string to the object and then some weight to the other side which will slowly pull up the object. Can you see that we needed fewer weights to pull up the object? So, an inclined plane is a simple machine. It helps us do our work with lesser effort. But you must remember that there's always a trade-off. The way an inclined plane works is that to save effort, you need to move things a greater distance. An inclined plane is a plane surface set at an angle other than right angle against a horizontal surface.
even the angle of the incline makes a difference. If the incline is gentle, we need lesser effort, but the extra distance we need to cover is more. If the incline is steep, the extra distance you need to travel is less, but the effort needed is more. If you compare the length of a ladder to that of a staircase going to the same height, you will find the distance on the ladder is much lesser. But it takes a lot more effort to climb a ladder than to simply walk up a flight of stairs. The ancient Egyptians figured this out over 3000 years ago when they built their pyramids. They used long shallow ramps to help them move the heavy stones to the top. Have you seen a road that winds up a hill? We call it a ghat. When we travel on this road, we move ahead a lot and we move up bit by bit. If the slope is gradual, we take longer to reach the top, but we can drive up a car with less power. So, even small cars can be driven on such slopes. You don't need to have very powerful vehicles. If the slope is steep, the road does not wind as much. Then only powerful cars can be driven up. This is the reason we build long winding roads to travel up a mountainside. A winding road is like an inclined plane. Can you explain how? Instead of going straight ahead as we do on a ramp, on a winding road, we go round and round. A screw is like a winding road too. We turn the screw around and gradually push it into the wood. The threads of a screw decide how fast or slowly it will push into the wood. Threads are the turns on the long edge of the screw. If the threads are very close together, then we have to turn it around more, but the screw slides in easily. If the threads are far apart, we have to use more force, but the screw enters the wood quickly. The screw is also a simple machine and it is just like an inclined plane. What did we just learn? Machines that have few or no moving parts are known as simple machines. The most simple machine is the inclined plane. It is a slanting ramp. If the slope of the inclined plane is gentle, the distance is greater, but the effort needed is lesser. If the slope of the inclined plane is steep, the distance is less, but the effort needed is more. A staircase is like an inclined plane. A winding road is also like an inclined plane. A screw is also like an inclined plane. 